It's safe to say things have been pretty strange lately. We're witnessing something that we, that we never actually thought we ever would. This outbreak, to a great degree, has changed the way we live and perceive life. This phase has been an emotional roller coaster, filled with a lot of changes. So, for instance, I picked up reading, which has always been something that I always wanted to get into, but never actually did. But I guess being trapped inside the four walls definitely did help. But it wasn't all rosy. Obviously, we we're going through a pandemic. So obviously there have been lows, real lows. I know that is life in general, but it's just that things have been a lot more apparent lately. The fear, the stress, feeling behind in life. All of these feelings creeped in a lot more. But all of this led to the realization that, to a degree, it all emanates from a lack of self-love. But don't get me wrong, wanting to do better, being competitive, all of those things aren't bad. They help give life purpose and meaning. But if it starts consuming you and hinders your normal functioning, then that obviously isn't healthy. It would just rob you of a lot of other beautiful aspects of life. A right balance between being content and wanting to grow is what I personally believe fosters well-being. One of the things that I really found comfort in was my everyday evening ambles. And one of the biggest reasons why I was because I felt a sense of togetherness despite the physical disconnect. The fact that we're going through this together has definitely brought us all a lot closer. That's what I feel. So this is how the period has been for me filled with highs and lows, uncertainties and growth.